on the cold, hard cement floor, I fall like a giant sack of grain, fighting for air. Fighting for air like a marathon runner on the finish line, my body is not ready to wait. It clutches and kicks and punches for attention. It has to be now, it demands. A deep dark red blotch attacks my dress, growing and growing and growing because my body, my body is not ready to wait. So straight on the night table they hurry me with their bloodshot eyes, eyes that do not realize they gleam with fear, fear of the unknown, fear of what is about to come. So I whisper, I chant, breathe in, breathe out, steady, steady my heart. A mantra, a prayer for the end of this nightmare But my body is not ready to negotiate It resists me, it fights, they fight it back A losing battle for the both of us They cut, they slice, they pull and it rips open His blood sprays and pulls on the table like a fountain I lose sense of the present But when I come to their lives Death in the form of a child, forever slept eyes accusing me. You should have protected me. You should have protected me. I cry, I cry, I cry of a thousand mothers, but my cry is like a fading whisper of the wind, unrecognizable, unheard, and understood. Now it is time that it is, because when you have held a life in your womb just to have it removed from you, it lives a permanent emptiness never to be filled even with a hundred births after. Every laughter of your children will remind you of the one that you never heard, the one you never raised. Their cries like the spear to the heart that never loved it back to life. When their eyes meet yours, you will remember the ones that never opened, the ones forever closed. Nothing in this world can compare and prepare you for the loss of a child. So let there be life.